So I've been wanting a turntable for a while now, and I came across this Arkspin table that I think after using it for about a month, it's really cool for photography and video, but not only that, but businesses too. So the turntable has a matte finish which leads to non-reflective shots, and it's also white which means it'll match any product that you put on there. On the back you'll see that you have a power jack and also a power switch. Now notice that you don't get any direction or speed control, and I'll talk about that a little bit later. But basically it turns at a very slow rotation, it's really quiet which is good, and pretty much that's all it does. It's literally just a piece of plastic that turns. But you might be wondering, well why am I paying $200 for this? Well, number one, you're getting a better build quality than all the other cheap knockoffs out there. And also that you get the software which comes with Arcspin. So it's really the magic in the software that makes the Arcspin product so good. And the hardware is pretty much just a white piece of rotating plastic. So anyways, guys, let's review this software now. So the entire point of Arcspin is to make 360 degree spins that you can put on websites, social media, and pretty much basically to help your business grow, whether you're selling clothes, um, toys, or whatever you want, you can make a spin of it, and then the product buyer will see a 360 degree view of your product, and hopefully that reduces return rates because they know exactly what they're getting. So basically what you do to create a spin is you go onto the Arcspin website, and then you log in and create an account. So once you're done with that, you want to upload a video of your object rotating for one and a quarter turns, and then Arcspin will automatically create a spin for you. And then after that, you can edit the spin. So what the editing allows you to do is obviously edit the spin, and there's a really cool function called dewobbler that I really like. Basically what it allows you to do is if you didn't place the object in the middle of the turntable and it wobbles around while you spin, you can fix that just by dragging it to the middle at a few points, and then it will automatically do all the processing for you, and it looks actually real. Another cool feature is curves. I really like this one because you can make the background completely white to give it that really, really professional look, even if you don't have a 100% perfectly white background. So I found that to be a really nice feature. Other than that, there are some quick and useful functions that pretty much everyone can use, and it's really just an easy way to get professional looking spins without any work much at all. And that leads me back to why there isn't variable speed or direction control. Because this is for making spins, not taking videos. It still works great for videos, but this is primarily just for spins. So these spins might be beneficial to customers that want to see a 360 degree view of the product. It's also beneficial to sellers because it might reduce the return rate of the people that are buying it because they know exactly what they're getting. So Arcspin is a really nice way to do all that stuff that I talked about earlier. Now, I'm not a business owner. I don't know if it actually helps a business, but I've seen some reviews that say it does. So I guess it does, but I'll primarily be using it for video, and for that, it works very well. So anyways, guys, thanks so much for watching this video, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.